Hey, what's happening, everyone? My name is Speed Streak. Welcome to Speed Streak Reviews, where we take a look at video games, movies, TV shows, comic books, or anything you grow in and see how they turn out. Now, for this review, we're going to be looking into part two of my Diamond Days review with the epic final episode, Change Your Mind. Now, if you haven't seen the Steven Universe show yet or haven't caught up with it yet, please do check it out. For this review, we'll be dealing with major, 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 major spoilers from this one hour special. Also, if you haven't seen part one of my Diamond Days review, there's a link for it right here. Okay, are you ready? Are you set? Are you all caught up? Okay then, let's look into the final Diamond Days episode, Change Your Mind. We see Steven in another dream of Pink Diamond in her prison as Blue Diamond berates her for her childish behavior, and Steven learns that Pink was miserable before waking up and seeing Blue coming. She scolds him for fusing with Connie and asks him to apologize, but he refuses. He told her that fusion is normal with the Crystal Gems and he knows what it's like to have a loving family. And when he reveals that Pink cries every time that she was locked up, Blue realized that she had been terrible at Pink and finally understands why she left. She releases Steven and Connie and helps them save the Crystal Gems, but Yellow Diamond confronts them. As Blue tries to reason with Yellow and fight her, Steven and Connie retrieve the Crystal Gems. Soon, Yellow attempts to poof Blue as she says that this is what White wants in order to maintain their perfect empire, but Steven stops her and tells her that if you try to make everything perfect, you lose everything that you love. Blue and Yellow soon forgive each other and guide Steven and Connie to Pink's ship, but White Pearl stops them as White Diamond connects her ship to Pink's. Suddenly, Blue and Yellow's repaired ships operated by Bismuth and the regenerated Lapis and Peridot appeared and fought White. After Steven tells Blue and Yellow that they have come so far in order to get White's attention, Blue and Yellow took control of their ships and subdued White's. But as Steven, and Blue and Yellow attempt to reason with her, White mind controls Blue and Yellow and as Connie grabs Steven, he accidentally drops the Crystal Gems. He falls after them and grabs them one by one, helping them regenerate through fusion, starting with Amethyst as Smoky Quartz, next with Pearl as the new Rainbow Mary Poppins, and finally with Garnet as Sunstone Johnny Bravo. We soon see Sunstone trying to hit to White's head, but White swatted her off. Garnet now realizes that all the Crystal Gems need to fuse in order to beat her. We soon get an attack on Titan, fight with the fused obsidian against White as Connie and the other crystal gems distract her. Eventually, obsidian disabled both the mechanic arms and made it to White's head. After separating, Steven and the others confront White as well as the brainwashed blue, yellow, diamond, and pink pearl. As White tells Steven that impurities and flaws are wrong, that the other gems are inferior and that she doesn't need him for she's quote unquote pure, she takes control of Amethyst, Garnet, and Pearl. Steven tries to tell her that his friends are fine the way they were, but White just laughs it off as the brainwashed Pearl captures Connie. And we soon see White grab Steven and, in the most intense part of the episode, she pries his gem out of him in order to take out Pink. When Steven woke up, he sees his gem morph into him, surprising White. When she asks, him wears pink. Pink Steven remarked, She's gone! As Connie helps Steven towards his pink self, White tries to stop him, but he deflected all of her attacks. And when Steven and his pink self got back, we got one of the most heartwarming scenes ever as Steven reunites with himself. White, stupefied, asks why he's acting like a child. Steven remarks he is a child, and he asks what's her excuse. Hearing this, she suddenly turns pink and loses her control, bringing everyone's free will back, as well as pink pearls. After the rest of the crystal gems rejoined, Steven goes to White and tells her that if she lets everyone be themselves, she'll be who she wants to be. But first, she has to leave her head. We cut to Beach City where we see Sadie with her rock band as we see the diamond ship land nearby and Steven reunites with his dad. We even see the off-color ship land as Lars reconciles with Sadie. Later, Steven, the diamonds, and the crystal gems gather all the 
corrupted gems and restored them, even Jasper. After the diamonds said their goodbyes, we see Garnet, Amethyst, and Pearl, and Steven enjoying one last song. Okay, what do I have to say about this arc except it is one of the best ones I have ever seen, especially with Change Your Mind. I still can't believe that this show started off with a kid who enjoys Cookie Cats to him becoming one of the greatest cartoon heroes ever. Change Your Mind has to be one of the greatest episodes this show has to offer. Not only does it have a great story, animation, action, and characters, but it also deals with neglect, abuse, realization, identity, and forgiveness. But is this the end of the series itself? Far from it. If you haven't seen it yet, please go check it out. It's an outstanding adventure with Steven Universe and the Crystal Gems as they help change the outlook of not only Homeworld, but the entire show as well. So that was my review for Steven Universe Change Your Mind. I mean, what do you guys think? Did you enjoy the conflict with Steven and the Diamonds? Do you like the Crystal Gems new looks? And what direction do you think this show would go through? Well, let me know in the comment section down below. So that's all the time I have today for this video, but don't go anywhere, it's got plenty of reviews to look forward to more soon. So stay tuned for more. So, thank you everyone for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to super smash that like button and leave a comment down below to see what you think. <laughs>